The managing director the Prince Builders and Junior Siri of Moegi in a solemn mood are the residents of the late police officer Michael Adams to commiserate with his family. My husband was a gallant officer. We will forever remember him. So very sorry for the loss. While condoling with the wife of the police officer killed in the line of duty, Mrs. Chizoba Adams, MD of the Prince Builders, described the late DSP Adams as a gallant officer and a patriot. He promised to offer employment to the widow in his company in any location of her choice and also made a donation. Me being here today is so touching that you have a 31 uh, year old woman, right? And the husband was just 34. And they have um, two kids, a boy and a girl, which one was uh, seven months old, the other was just two, two years old. So it's very touching. So I've paid my own part, I've given her the check, and also tell her for about the employment. If she's ready, she can come, we can give her employment in Benin, Lagos, or in Abuja, in any of the Prince Bidas offices nationwide. We thank God for everything, and I just pray that uh, God give the woman um, the grace to overcome this, uh, this burden. For the 31-year-old widow of the late police officer, her husband was dear to her. The pain is too much. I was not expecting it, because it's not the first time my husband is going for an oppression. This one is just a simple one. So, the pain, the shock alone, it's not that I'm a strong woman. I would have been in sick bed, but I'm just doing it. I'm just holding myself because of the sake of the, the children. If not, my sister, I don't even know where to start. During the condolence visit, Mitchell Adams, Heather's child of late DSP Michael Adams, who is less than two years old, wept profusely. Hey. Sorry, now nah, it's okay. I am. I am. Talk, talk. I don't tell ya. I don't tell ya. The 34 year old DSP Michael Adams will be remembered for his exploits as a police officer who died in the line of duty during the rescue operation of kidnapped victims. Deborah Ubefun reporting.